you have 14 and out, I mean, what does it mean to cap that off? Um, yeah, it's something that was really special, and I definitely said, it, I mean, it's a goal every year to defend our home court, and a lot of just credit to our fans. I thought they were awesome today, and just all throughout the season. So, games when we were down and we were trying to fight back, they would sometimes cheer for us loud and get us the momentum back, and it was awesome. I mean, what, you're way ahead, I mean, real early. I mean, what does it feel like? Obviously, you've had some games you had to come back, but to actually play it all the way through where you're up by that. Yeah, it feels great. Um, Coach always says, you know, she doesn't really want us to, it's great to come back and land, but she wants us to, you know, to get the, the first four minutes is really important and to get out and to um, get out with a, get out strong. And so I thought we came out with a purpose. And um, like Amanda said, you know, the crowd was, it was crazy, the atmosphere to play um, our last home game in front of, in front of our home fan. There's really nothing like playing in front of Hoosier Nation. They're awesome. But what was key to that? I mean, why do you think you guys were able to execute so well offensively? Um, I just felt like we were very prepared coming into it. Um, not only that, you know, it was a big night for Lindsay, so, you know, that got all of us pretty pumped for her. You know, we wanted to go out with the band for her, so it meant a lot. Why? she I mean, she's like our bigger sister, you know? She's, she's very important to us all, um, I hope. <laughs> but, um, you know, it's her last time, so, you know, as you can see, she was emotional coming out, so, you know, I'm just happy we got that for her. Like, how did you guys you know, try to block out all the you know, scoreboard watching, you know, try to go into feed home, all the storylines surrounding this game? How do you kind of block that out throughout the week, you know, preparing for this? I mean, you just, you just have to. You know, you take one day at a time, you know, um, you know go through practices, getting through prep, um, you know, just focus on one game at a time. I think five of you guys had double digit scoring. Just how nice is it that it was a little bit of everybody today? Yeah, I think that's something we definitely talked about before, was just to have balance scoring, um, throw it in and throw it out. Don't just settle for necessarily threes or all post shots. So I think that we did a good job of executing that and getting everyone the ball and everyone touches. What were you guys doing defensively, to, especially with Paige, their leading scorer, to stop her and to stop it? Because they were uh, just two of their teams in the three. Um, I think we were really active in our zone, and um, even when they set ball screens, and our post did a really good job of kind of showing, and our guards did a really good job of getting underneath screens and getting back to the, um, getting back under for, um, you know, to get back to the guards. And I thought we did a really good job of just communicating, and that's a big thing, especially when we play zone. Um, communicating is one of the biggest things because you know you don't really want to settle back in the zone. But uh, I think we were really active, and I think that really helps um, to our to our offense as well. And how big of Minnesota fans do you guys going to be tomorrow? <laughs> Oh yeah, definitely. You know, from the very start, you know, we came out there and we just looked up and saw all the fans. You know, it was, it was loud in there. You know, we were ready. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Guys.